For years, the question facing the Neiman Girls soccer team was, could they get beyond the sectional semifinals and finally capture a sectional title? Well, not only did they answer that question last year, but they put an, the exclamation point on it with an undefeated state championship season. So now the challenge becomes, what do they do for an encore? Well, the title defense started Wednesday, September 7th, under the lights of Mo Memorial Field against rival Wellesley. To the highlights we go. We are in a scoreless first half, but Needham is threatening to get on the board just before halftime. Olivia Grief gets it down to Hannah Smith, and she'll send it on over to Korea Baker Durante. But her contested shot goes just high over the crossbar. We are tied nil-nil midway through this one. But a strong start to the second half for Needham, much like they had a lot of games last year. Five minutes in, the ball gets sent down the left side. It's going to be chased down by Baker Durante. She crosses in front over to Smith, and well, the sophomore knows how to bury that one. That's the first goal of the season and the first lead of the season for Needham. But hey, the Rockets are just getting started because 30 seconds later, the Rockets are right back on the hunt. They get it up ahead once more to Korea, and she's going to catch the goalkeeper out of position and knocks home a 20 yard strike beautifully to the upper right hand corner. It's two to nothing, Needham. They look like they could be clear sailing, but hold on because Wellesley, they're looking to spoil the fun. 52nd minute, Raiders, they're going to send a bouncing cross to the middle. Watch this one. It trickles through a handful of defenders, finds the foot of Olivia Francis as she steps up and beats Liz Valentini, only beaten eight times last year. So that right there is a rare goal for the freshman. 75th minute now, though. Grief, she's looking to clinch this one for Needham. She has the free kick. She steps up and hits just over the outstretched arm of the goalie. Three to one, that would make the score and that would end up being your final. And if you need them, well, you can't draw it up much better than they had in this game. Three of your top offensive weapons score. You take home win number one under the lights and you keep the 300th cup in Needham, of course. So the Rockets, they have another home game uh, this Friday, September 9th against Framingham. And after that, they'll have three away games in league play. Well, Micah Haubin, the director of athletics at Needham High, was recognized by the National Interscholastic Athletic Administrators Association as a certified master athletic administrator. And in a press release from September 1st, the NIAAA awarded Haubin with this distinction, noting his knowledge, contributions, and commitment to future development in athletic administration. And switching sides now, Needham's Allie Raisman will take part in the 2016 Kellogg's Tour of Gymnastics Champions beginning September 15th. The tour celebrates sports skill and athletes. Along with Raisman and her Final Five teammates, the cast includes Chris Brooks, Jake Dalton, Nastia Lukin, Sean Johnson, and many more. The athletes will make stops in 36 cities, starting in Spokane, Washington on the 15th and ending with shows at the TD Garden here in Boston on November 13th.